Detectives, found something here you probably want to see. All right. That was my hat. Dead motherfucker, right there. Ernesto. If you want an address, we should see what the Federales have on it. Okay. One dollar per dead man. Doesn't seem like much for a human life. That's it. Is that all they wanted me to see? Damn. I think we found our stash, Cole. Take a look in these boxes. Yep. At the very minimum, another 50 pounds. Detectives, I think we got the guy. Does the name Cruz mean something to you? Yep. Certainly does. It's a lot of cash. Must be a thousand dollars here. Ah. Then you have ID on him. There we go. Yet another silver dollar. M18. Looks like quite a bloodbath. What was this all about? Drugs and money. What else? Speaking of money, where did that roll go? I picked it up for safekeeping. The department owes me 50. Ray, I have another two coins for you. Great. I've got something to show you. All right. It's all set up on the table over here. There. Take a look at these coins you've been collecting. There are letters cut into each coin, along with not legal tender. Those are Morgan silver dollars from the 20s. They were removed from circulation and sent for disposal. A number of smelters around the country had the contract. Look at them together. Can you work out what it says? All right. M-A-S-A-N-G-K-A-Y. What was it again? M A S A N G K A Y. The first coin, M A S. The second, A N G. The third, K A Y. The fourth, M E T. The fifth, A L S. The Sang K Metals. A metal foundry. Would you like the address? 
would I ever? Yeah. 1034 Vine Street, Hollywood. We'll finish up here. It's already been a long night, Phelps. See if you can talk them into giving themselves up. Let's go. Where the hell's the exit at? Oh, we gotta go upstairs, that's right. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Where are we going? Right there. That's where we're going, fool. I hope that big wad of cash doesn't weigh you down. Get your priorities straight, Phelps. We're close to bringing in one of the biggest dope cases of the year, and you're worrying about unsubstantial evidence? Yeah, drive through the fucking gate. All right, let's go find another way in. No, nope, probably not that way. Right here. Full house. It's over five. God damn it. You went one Cover the back door, Roy. I'm taking my money and going home. That fuck whose turn it is to mine shop. Hey, what can I say? I got lucky. Bullshit. You're cheating, and I'm gonna catch you at it before the night is out. Not deal. Throw out the guns. Tell you when I see what's waiting for us at the top. Weapons on the ground now. Catch him, find some cover. I will take that.
Get in cover! Victor Sanders. You know this guy? I should have known. Of course I know Roy. Roy and I have had an arrangement for Get many up. years. You're under arrest. Am I? We have a mountain of prima facie evidence, as well as the testimony. You'd be surprised how things have a habit <clears throat> of sorting themselves out. Evidence disappearing. Witnesses that can't be found. Policemen that forget. The impossible becomes probable when you have a client list like mine. Shut your mouth! Turn around and put your hands behind your back. Working vice can be a thankless task, Phelps. But on behalf of the brass and the moms and dads and the concerned citizens, I'd like to commend you and your partner for smashing this dope ring. Reefer is almost as big a threat to the children of this city as communism. What about Sanders, Lieutenant? Leave Sanders to me, Phelps. The chief will be looking after that one personally. He will be brought to trial. Phelps, we are celebrating your success. Don't push your luck. Sanders is no longer your problem. They're gonna let him go. Every herb bearing seed. Oh, damn. Okay, at least I found all the clues. Sanchez is a family man and would have ratted out his bosses if he saw the evidence stacking against him. Okay. So that's where I screwed up. Oh, well. Let's see if we've got a cut scene or if we're going in the next one. Back to the war. Your platoon is what remains of recon folding you into the 22nd. You'll be going up that damn hill tonight. We're intelligence gathering, sir. I don't need intelligence, son. I need men who can hold rifles and kill Japs. Tonight, you're a rifle company. We've got cooks, mechanics, and stretcher bearers all going into the line. We aim to break them tonight, Lieutenant. Good to see you, Hank. You too, Cole. How's your war? Not quite what I expected. As long as I live, I will never get over that sound. Hey, who's that medic? He'll be killed going out there. It's Sheldon, the guy from the Altacala Bridge. That guy's got no fear. <laughs> didn't make it. I didn't go out there to save him. What are you saying, man? I went out there to put him out of his misery, to ease his pain. Do you have a problem with that? Murder, Corman. That's war, Lieutenant. Smell the stench. Feel the horse's breath on your neck. You need help, man. Call for me tonight, Lieutenant. When you're up on that hill. I've been up there three times already. The circles of hell have nothing on Sugarloaf Hill. Get this madman out of my sight! Hmm. Hmm. So he could in their ass. Oh, that shit. There we go, guys. So we got Reefer Madness done. <laughs> We're getting into our next one. So I'm going to go ahead and say adieu. We will see you on the next one, guys. And this is Snapshot reminding you, the gamer, do what? Keep on gaming. See you.